what's up today my fellow man soldiers so what we're gonna be doing right now is adding new members to the 99 exclusive club that i'm actually building so before we get into it what i want to ask if you guys right now if you guys can subscribe to the channel please go ahead and do that right now and hit that notification bell right next to it to get notified each and every time i upload something and if you guys are liking the content please drop a like on the video i can't wait to do more especially when madden 21 drops and even before then to break down more 20 madden 21 when they actually release information on it so anyways if you guys want to know any of the information go ahead and make sure to hit that notification bell so as you can tell we're 99 overall but like i said it's a 99 overall because everyone on the squad is a 99 right now we don't got everyone we don't got everyone in the lineup but those who are in the, in the lineup are 99s um especially when it comes to them being starters that's what i mean so that's why it says 99 but little by little we're rebuilding it this is the second video on this um so who we're gonna who we're gonna we're gonna power up three guys right now we're gonna power up a left tackle we're gonna power up a left guard and we're gonna power up a tight end that's what we're gonna power up right now but if you're just tuning in and you guys don't know what's going on i'm gonna go ahead and introduce you to the squad so what's going on is that i'm rebuilding a 99 squad what i want to do is i want to leave madden 20 I want to leave Madden 20 with a 99 squad. So if later on I want to go back and revisit it and do some throwbacks, we got a good squ squad to grind, grind with. And we also have a Dallas Cowboys squad. If you guys just tuned in, you guys don't know yet. So, anyways, um, this is our defense. We're working on it. Um, I'm trying to get another little middle linebacker. We're going to work on a right outside linebacker. Um, we got our safeties we want. We got our left outside line. Um, Left outside linebackers we want. We got a few more too that are not actually in the lineup. But if we need them, we go get them. Um, cornerbacks, we're working on those. Yes, I do got Deion Sanders and so forth. They will be in the lineup. Um, but we're trying to work on two gold 99s and then we'll add the rest later on. Um, I do have a 99 gold free safety. We don't want to know. If, I, don't know I, I might add him. I haven't decided yet if I want to keep him. But we'll figure that out. And uh, our kicker and punter are 99s. So that's what we have. So let's go ahead and go to our offense because we are going to be powering up. Um, a left tackle right now. I forgot there was a left tackle I had before. I forgot who it was. Um, we do have Tyron Smith. He, we will put him in as our backup, but I forgot to put him in as our backup. But anyways, where's our left tackle? Uh, oh, we think we had Jordan. No, we had no. That was a long time ago. Was it Larry Little? No, he's the right guard. We have Walter, I forgot who we had. We had someone as our left. Oh, Joe Thomas. We used to have him as our left tackle. So where is this guy at? Here he is. This is who we're going to power up. Andrew Whiteworth. Um, he was part of the power up expansion program. So it makes it a little bit easier for us to power him up. Go ahead and uh, yeah, make it happen. One of his cards, I think is Corey Z, is not on the auction block, but what I'm hoping is, I'm hoping that we actually have a, we should have a power-up pass, though. That's what I'm hoping. Because if not, yeah, sex for minor, minor. So let's go see if there, if he's actually on the auction block yet, though. But if not, we'll go ahead and use that piece, because we, so, oh, yeah, he actually is. Okay, we'll buy him. 25K coins, we'll go ahead and buy it. Yeah, earlier he wasn't on the auction block, so someone put him up. That's actually a lot for an 84, but, you know, he's only one up, and it's not that bad. Some people some people try to put it up for, like, 30, 40K. Um, they didn't do that then, so I'm, I'm cool with that. So, now we got to go back. It's acting funny right now. Okay, so let's go get him. So there it is. Yeah, I like to put the core elites if they're not that much. I like saving the power passes, usually for cards that are overpriced. So this is the only card that she, he he should actually have, and then the rest should just be power ups. I mean, um, to, um, the rest you should be able to add training. Yeah, he doesn't have no other cards after this, so that's why it's a little bit better, and more cost effective to do it like this because all you have to do is buy training. It's cheap to buy training. Okay, so it shouldn't be bad. There we go. So there he is. He's up to a 99. He got 66 speed, though, which is not that fast. Joe Thomas is a lot faster. Um, but it is what it is. I'm not tripping. You know, I mean, I could have went back and got Joe Thomas, but, you know, I'm going to leave it as that. But his abilities, just in case you guys are wondering. So apparently he gets all the abilities. He gets identifier, secure protector, post up, all day, power blocker, zone blocker, puller elite, edge protector, run block elite, 
Nasty Streak, Threat Detector, and Pass Block Elite. I mean, yeah, Pass Block, yeah, Pass Block Elite. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. So, who, we're at Rams. I don't, I don't think we have any Bengals, so we might have some Rams or something. Do we? So, we have two, apparently, already. Should I put Zone Run or go deep? Um, I don't know who I actually, let, let, me, let me go see what I actually have. Because I got to start putting Brawler and stuff. I got to go back and, like, you know, rearrange everything. Because a lot of people I got Sprinter on. So let's go see what we got. What we got going on. So we got Zone Run 21, Go Deep 23. Remember, we're going to have backups and everything, too. So we got Sprint 39. So what we're going to do is we're going to start working on the Brawler. Okay, so we're going to put, we'll put Go Deep on them. Okay, so we're gonna put Brawler. I don't think I have many people right now on the lineup of Brawler, but like I said, though, little by little, we're gonna start. We'll, 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 we'll work on it. So when you have 10, it's fine. We'll work on that. So that's this Corey Lee. I don't want this one. I don't like that card art. This one looks a little bit better, so go ahead and go with that one. Now we're gonna check out his stats, see how he's looking. So far, the speed I can rate really tell I don't like, but it's fine. It is what it is. I think they all run the same anyway. I thought I said 97 speed. I was like, wow. Anyway, so he comes in at 6'7", 97 strength, 98 awareness, 99 pass block, 97 pass block power, power, 99 pass block finesse, 96 wrong block, 94 wrong block power, and 96 wrong block finesse. So his card is actually good. The only thing, like I said, is the speed, but I mean, you don't have to really be running that fast out there, so it's fine. So that's cool. Um, so what was the last, next one we're gonna power up? Oh, the left guard. This is the left guard that I actually had before. So, Joe Turney. And we can actually put Cowboy Kim on him just to have have it on him. He's not gonna be in the Cowboy squad, but we can actually put the Kim on him on this, on our main, main account. I mean, on our main squad. So where's this card at? Do I have to go way down here to get him? Oh, here he is. I must have powered them all the way down huh, when I got rid of them. All right, let's, so let's start working on it. See how see how I went down to a 98 overall because we have because he came in at a 74. That's why. But once we power him up to a 99, he'll go. The team will go back up to a 99. So we should have the card. Yeah, there it is. Oh, so I already had two of them. I want, I want to go buy them again. I checked too, and I didn't see it. It's all right. It's fine. I can use it for training for something. This car. I remember this car when it. I mean, when when his car first came out, this '91 right here that he has was going for like 300, 400k. Yeah, it was insane. All right, so we got this. We did buy his car. It's not bad. It, his 98 is only going for like 100K, so it, it's pretty reasonable. All right. So just in case you guys are wondering, he gets all the same abilities that the uh, left tackle we powered up does, so we don't have to go ahead and read all that. And he should be able to get them on all three tiers. Yeah, yeah on all three tiers, he gets the same thing, so that's good. So we'll put Cowboy Kim on him. No, he's not going to go to the Cowboy squad, but for here, we'll put Cowboy Kim on him, so it really don't matter. Then we'll put... She's here. We'll put zone run on them. It's fine. Switch it up. Eventually, we have everything maxed out either way. Because like I said, little by little, we're building it up so we don't. Um, we're going to put Brawler on him, of course. Our, our linemen are eventually going to have Brawler. And we'll look at his actual... So it's card art. Is that, I really don't... It's not really all that, though. I want this one, though, for some reason. So we'll go ahead and add that. Something different, because the last time I had the other one, so change it up now we'll look at his stats see how he's looking but remember though i have i do have a lot of cowboy cams so he's gonna be a lot more juice than um probably a lot of people who don't have a theme team because if you have a theme team you can have his you can add the team cam on it so anyone should be able to get them to this if they have a uh, theme team but anyways he comes at 6 5 94 strength 99 awareness 99 pass block 97 pass block power 
99 pass block finesse, 97 run block, 92 run block power, and 98 run block finesse. The run block will go up more once we have it maxed out. So I'm glad I actually put zone run because apparently he needed it better when it came to his run blocking. Now what we're going to add, we're going to add our tight end. He's probably going to eventually end up be, being our starter. We do have some other tight ends, as you can tell, which will probably go to a 99. We're going to add eventually, which is um, Darren Waller. He will be at it probably as our third. But right now, we're going to add Jordan Reed. He uh, he should go up to a 90. He, or he will go up to a 99 goal. He was one of the ones part of the Power Up Expansion Program. Let me go ahead and find this card, though. Jordan Reed. There right, we go. So we'll fully power him up. All right, let's go. If I need more training, I have, I have tons of more. I, I'm not going to run out in this video, but eventually I'll probably end up running out. But we have players with tons of training. So his speed should already be good. He's already starting out at 71 speed as a low overall. So he should go up. Most likely, I say he's going to end up being our starter because he's fast. Add that. He has a few cards. I don't think he has like a lot of cards. So. And we do have the power pass if we needed it right there. So that's good. All right. So this is the last card that he actually had. Before you, we could power him up to a 99. So it doesn't take that much to, to, to get his cards. It's not that much. So everything else will be training. It just takes, like I said, quite a bit of training. But like I said, training is cheap. You could get training real cheap if you need it. Okay, so it's 44K. It's not bad. See? So anyways, so for his X-Factor, he gets double me, rack him up, max security, and then he gets mossed. For his abilities, first tier slot, he gets clutch, indoor baller, homer, Streak Specialist, Matchup Nightmare, Double Move Elite, Cross Specialist, Post Specialist, In Specialist, Out Corner Elite, In and Out Elite, Slotomatic, In Post Elite, Red Zone Threat, Tight End Apprentice, wow, he gets all kinds of Post Flag Elite, Outside Apprentice, Curl Comeback, Slot Apprentice, Playmaker, Route Apprentice, wow, and Tank. Oh, he actually gets tanked. Ooh, breaks, hit, hit stick, tackles. So we're probably going to add... Ooh, I didn't even know he got that. So we're going to have to add that on him. Uh, we might end up activating all that. But anyways, let's see what else he gets on all his other abilities. Yeah, so he's going to get the same thing on all his other abilities. Yeah, so he doesn't get these other ones. But that's actually a lot of abilities. Wow. Uh, we most likely will activate the tank. So we're not going to do it right now, though. But we'll see how it goes when I, when I look at back at my squad. We'll put zone run. Better pass blocking. And then we're going to put Sprinter on him times two. All right. Fawn Art. Let's see what we got one to put on him. I actually like that one. We'll go ahead and put that one there. That one actually looks kind of it looks realistic. <clears throat> All right. So now we're going to check out his stats. So it's team little by little coming together. You know, it's just a process building it. That's what it is. So I actually like that. It actually looks it actually looks nice. So anyways, also, yeah, definitely gonna be a starter. He comes in at 6'2, 93 speed, 70 strength, 99 catching, 96 catching traffic, 97 spectacular catch, 97 short route run, 94 medium route run, 72 run block. So run block went up because we put the zone run on him, so that's good. It'll go up even more once we add uh max out the uh, zone run. But anyways. That's what we added. We added uh, another Andrew Whiteworth, Joe Turney, and then Jordan Reed, uh, which Jordan Reed is going to be our starter, so we'll switch him up right now before we end this. Jason wins at 96 speed, so it's not too bad, but Jordan Reed is a lot better. Jason wins a good blocker or when he's a red zone threat, so there it is there. Um, we will be adding some more. Let's add this uh, third tight end real quick. He's not a gold, but he is a goon, and he should be able to go to a 99 right now with blue cams at least. Because we have tons of, uh, yeah, he should. Yeah, so we went up to a 99 with blue Kims. And I think he's even faster, too. Yeah, see, so he's 96 speed. He's coming in at 6'6", 96 speed, 70 strength, 
97 catching, 97 catching traffic, 99 spectacular catch, 89 short route run, 83 medium route run, 80 run block. So his run block is even better. So we got three goons of a tight end. If we ever get more tight ends, we it's cool. But we, I'm going to ride with the tight ends right now. Like I said, little by little, we're building the team up. We, next video, we should be working on defense. I want to add at least three members to the defense. So we'll go see who we're going to add. If you guys have any suggestions, let me know. Um, but anyways, I'm going to leave it right here. If you guys like what you've seen, drop a like. If you guys have any subs, subs to the channel, there will be more great, amazing content coming your way. Thank you guys all for tuning in. I'm out.